Taja Khan of stateofruckers.com here with the father of Ryan Brody, who just committed to the Rutgers Scarlet Knights. How you doing, sir? How you doing? Very good, very good. Um, talk a little bit about this this great occasion and, and, and what this day means to you as a father. Um, it's a little, it's relieving, but it, I'm a, it's a proud moment, you know. He picked the college that he wanted to go to, and uh, you know, it's it's a good day. I'm, I'm, I'm overjoyed. Okay. Now, I know you guys have been on the Rutgers campus um, multiple times. Uh, what was it that you experienced throughout that those visits that made you uh, enticed to select the Scarlet Knights? Uh, I think the uh, closeness of the team, you know, the coaching staff, the uh, proximity from our, from our home to the university. And Ryan, I, I think Ryan wanted to play early, trying to, you know, at least attempting to play early. So, you know, Rutgers is right up the road. He feels like he can, you know, start working out early and, you know, getting up there early. Okay. Now, Ryan is a young man that I've gotten to know uh, over the past couple years. I remember first seeing him at uh, a sophomore event of Chuck Mounds. He's really developed uh, since that time. But just give um, the Rutgers fans out there a better idea of who uh, Ryan is as a person. Uh, he moves to his own beat, you know. He's a humble kid, you know. He, he's a hard-working kid, you know. He's not a he's not a quiet kid as you might think he is, but uh, you know he's he, he's just a good kid, good all around kid, you know. Okay, and as far as the direction of the Rutgers football program, they seem to be doing um, some big things um, on the field as well as recruiting wise. Um, what are your expectations for your uh, son's time at Rutgers? Uh, I expect Rutgers to to win the Big East, BCS Bowl within the next four to five you know next four to five years, however long he's there. I think that, you know, with the recruiting classes over the last two years, back to back, two great recruiting classes, you can only get better. Okay. And you guys had a lot of different options out there, um, a lot of schools clamoring to get your son uh, on campus, being that he's a, a big time prospect. But at the end of the day, you guys selected Rutgers. If, if, if there was just one thing that you could think of that stood out about Rutgers above all the other schools, what would you say that, that was? Uh, that stood out above Rutgers. Coaching staff. Okay. Coaching staff. So you've had a the pretty fam, good... Yeah. The fam, the tightness, the family relationship. Right. You know? Okay. So you've had a pretty good relationship with those guys? Pretty good, yeah. Okay. And they're out here um, a lot lately recruiting the Shore Conference, giving you guys a little bit of love. Yeah, uh, talk a little bit about that evolution, Rutgers uh, poking their nose over in this neck of the woods. I mean, it's, it's a lot of good football out here. I think... Uh, I actually think this is some of the best football in the state, you know, but, uh, you know, I'm biased and uh, I played in the shore and my kids played in the shore, but it's a lot of good athletes down there and a lot of, a lot of talent here that, you know, you'll, I think you'll see over the next few years, you'll see how talented some of these kids from the shore are. Okay. And uh, lastly, do you have a message out there for the uh, Rutgers fans out there? Go Knights. <laughs> there you have it. This is SOR. We're signing off.